Junior want to not be on my mm. I can't really see what did I miss mm. Mm. Extra pursuit Today I'll be doing an initial unboxing and review for this 38 inch wig that I purchased myself off Aliexpress. I just finished getting ready because I'm supposed to be going to a carnival. I just did my wig and makeup. I got home at 7. It is 8 o'clock. Who you know? Who you know? The wig came in this. I don't know. Okay, so the wig came in this pink bag. This is from Wig Go Go. Wig Go Go, if I'm not mistaken. So, this is it, and it says 38 on the little sticker on the front. Um, I am a avid AliExpress hair buyer. I've been buying hair off AliExpress since high school. So I'm not new to this, I'm true to this. See? Let's open this up. So, other than the wig, we have these wig caps and a $10 cash back coupon if I do a review. Okay. And then we have the wig. So, ooh, my wigs. I'm gonna tie it down. Cause I feel it shifting. Okay, so this is the wig. I got a 38 inch curly unit. 13 by six. What? Oh, oh my gosh. So this wig comes with a band. That's cool. This is a really big frontal. Like it's not a frontal it's a lace front but it does have a nice amount of parting space on the sides or this is just a big ass wig I don't know <laughs> it looks good so smells like any hair you could ever order so it's let me stand up and show y'all the length so I'm five five unstretched this wig stops right about where this wig stops. And this is a 34 inch wig. So let's see stretched. Oh, but this wig is wet. So stretch, it goes past my butt. So, yes. To the front. This what it looks like in the front. I don't know, this is a pretty nice length. Yeah, I'm actually gonna tie this wig down because I feel it shifting, and I gotta keep this shit on until at least Sunday. And I don't have time for this shit to come off. Sorry, not sorry. I have a measuring tape so I can get a accurate length of how long this wig is. Like I said, it's advertised as. 38 so I'm gonna do from the top of the wig so unstretched we're coming in at 34 inches like I said the wig I have on now is about 34 inches and then stretched it's actually exactly 38 inches from the top of the frontal a little past 38 from the top. But if we start from like right here, it's about 36 from the side of the frontal, if that makes sense. So, is it true to length? Technically, yes, it is true to length. If we're starting from the front of the frontal all the way to the end, uh, this band really shocked me. I'm not gonna lie. 
This is a pretty curl texture. It's tighter than this one, I believe. Looking at the lace, the knots are actually relatively small. It's not pre-plugged, but it is a nice hairline. I wish, I'm so sad that it's getting dark. See, it's a really nice hairline. Let me see. Okay, so yeah. That's this. I'm going to install this wig this next Thursday. So that's going to be in a whole separate video because I'm doing a prep video. So if you want to stay tuned and see what this wig looks like it's time, then it will be up after this video, probably a week later. So thank y'all for watching this initial unboxing and review. Like I said, this wig is from, let me just check. I just have my phone. <laughs> okay, this wig is from Wig Go Go Hair and Wig Go Go Hair. Yes, it's a 13 by 6 lace front wig, 38 inches, and it's 180% density. I don't think I said that, but knowing me, I'll put it up on the screen at the beginning. And this wig after taxes was 226 $227.43, okay, so 38, 36-inch wig for $200. Okay, girl. If you want to complain, you can complain, but that sounds like a steal to me. And overall, the hair is really soft. Off the bat, it is soft. It is tangling, but bitch, it's curly hair. And we do have some shedding. So, 